Hey there, Dr. Mamina here. And today we're gonna to get into something that I know a lot of you are either very amused by, especially the removal of them, or are just curious about how to treat them for your own personal goals. And that's blackheads. Let me break it all down for you from what causes blackheads to how to prevent and treat them. So here we go. I bet almost all of us have encountered a blackhead or two or multiple, whether that be on your nose, cheeks, anywhere else on your face, and even on your body. Blackheads are small clogged pores filled with excess oil and dead skin cells. They turn black when the sebum or oil and dead skin cells are exposed to oxygen. They oxidize, which causes discoloration inside the pore. Whiteheads are white because they're still not exposed to oxygen. You probably most commonly see blackheads on your nose, and that's because it has a higher concentration of sebaceous glands or or oil glands in each of the little hair follicles or what we more often refer to as pores. Sebaceous glands secrete sebum or oil. So when there's more oil, there's a higher chance for the small hair follicles to get clogged, which then results in more blackheads. Blackheads are also more common in teens and young adults because they just produce a lot more oil. But you know, don't be surprised if you do get them when you're older too. I also find that men have blackheads more than women, mostly because they do produce more oil, but also because they may not always follow much of a skincare routine. But even if you're older, you can still get blackheads. If you're older and you have some damaged skin or you're just naturally a big oil producer, then you'll still notice them on your face. That's because people who have a lot of sun damaged skin, the sun damage actually can weaken your collagen, which then can weaken the wall structure of your pores, allowing the pores to expand and fill more with sebum and dead skin. Speaking of damaged skin, there's also a condition I wanna mention called favre Rakushou syndrome, which consists of a bunch of blackheads and whiteheads on the sides of the upper face. It's typically seen in older white men or heavy smokers. It's just because there's a lot of sun damage and collagen breakdown, and it allows pores to get filled with contents to create blackheads. With more severe blackhead conditions like this or some others, isotretinoin or retinoids are great alleviators. But let's dive further into the prevention and treatment of blackheads, no matter what your age or gender is. So there are three things to address when it comes to treating and preventing blackheads. And that's oil buildup, keratin or dead skin cell buildup, and then the strength of the pore walls. So let's talk about oil buildup first. It's essential to use products that either absorb excess oil or decrease oil production to help prevent blackheads. My favorite ingredient for this is salicylic acid. Products like the Inkylis salicylic acid acne and blackhead cleanser or La roche posay Epiclar salicylic acid acne treatment serum or Paula's Choice Skin Perfecting 2% BHA liquid exfoliant. These are very effective because they bind to oil and extract it directly from your pores. But there are also other great ingredients that help treat and prevent blackheads like clay-based masks. So things like cowl and clay and then ingredients including charcoal. Some products I like are the Aztec Secret Indian Healing Clay or the Kiehl's Rare Earth Deep Pore Minimizing Cleansing Clay Mask. And if you have serious oil buildup where you need a more systemic treatment to reduce your body's overall oil production, then I recommend talking to your doctor about getting on Accutane or Isotretinoin or Spironolactone. And later in the video, I'm gonna talk about how diet can affect blackheads. Okay, so now that we got the oil part covered, let's address the other aspects of blackhead management. That's keratin buildup as well as the wall of your pore. So I wanna address both of these at once because you'll use a lot of the same ingredients and products to work on both of these issues. To help decrease the buildup of dead skin cells, use products that will increase your skin cell turnover to further exfoliate your skin. Retinoids are the ingredient that we love that can increase skin cell turnover. So these include tretinoin, which is a prescription or over-the-counter options or things like adapalene. They help speed up cell turnover, preventing clogging in your pores. Over-the-counter options I like are La Roche Posay's Epiclar Adapalene Gel, the 0.1% or Differin Adapalene Gel, also 0.1%. If you have more sensitive skin, you may want to consider a more gentle option with a retinol like CeraVe's Resurfacing Retinol Serum. AHAs or alpha hydroxy acids like glycolic acid and lactic acids, as well as fruit enzymes can also help exfoliate and keep your skin looking more fresh and radiant. Dr. Dennis Gross's Alpha Beta Daily Peel Pads are a great product for this. Retinoids are also perfect when addressing the strength of the wall of your pore because you want to support the collagen that is keeping that hair follicle wall intact. Otherwise, the pore will just easily expand when contents fill the pore. Alpha hydroxy acids like glycolic acid can also really help with this too. So all these different ingredients that I mentioned, the alpha hydroxy acids and the retinoids, these all work together to help both with the keratin buildup as well as the strength of the pore wall. 
There's also a unique ingredient that I've seen recently that can support the integrity of your pore wall, and that is lentil seed extract. And this is specifically found in Philosophy's Purity Pore Minimizing Serum. And let me tell you, it will not disappoint. I have been a fan. There are also some other additional factors that can influence the development of blackheads, as well as more powerful types of treatments. So when it comes to your diet, sugar and dairy can definitely contribute to clogged pores. They kind of make your skin cells and your oil more sticky, so it kind of prevents them from naturally shedding. And then this results in them clogging your pores. So keeping an eye on your dietary choices can actually go a long way in preventing blackheads. And if you're looking for a more extreme long-term treatment, there are procedures that can help tackle blackheads head on. Chemical peels are great for exfoliating your skin's top layers and promoting a smoother complexion. Getting extractions during a facial can also be a game changer, but mostly for the initial appearance of your blackheads. It's important to pair these procedures with the right products and skincare routine to maintain results and ensure you don't get blackheads coming back. Now, if you're dealing with more severe blackhead issues or you have scarring where like the pores are just permanently open, then you might wanna consider procedures like microneedling or resurfacing laser treatments. They can help improve the overall texture of your skin and minimize the appearance of scars left behind from like those persistent blackheads. But as always, you wanna speak with your dermatologist first before moving forward with any of these procedures to just make sure that they fit your skin type and your skin needs. So before we wrap, I wanna share a few quick tips for blackhead prevention. First and foremost, don't forget your sunscreen. Sun exposure can actually exacerbate blackhead issues. So just make it a daily habit to put your sunscreen on in the morning and even more importantly, reapply. Second, as I mentioned, your diet does play a role too. So keep an eye on your food choices, especially when it comes to sugar and dairy. And finally, when it comes to your skincare routine, just make sure you incorporate a couple of blackhead powerhouse products into your daily regimen. I would say that my top two recommendations are a retinoid and a salicylic acid. And there you have it. That's my guide on treating and preventing blackheads. I hope you found this video on blackheads helpful. If you enjoyed this video and you want to learn more about blackheads or acne, be sure to download my free gift, my top five skincare favorites. And remember to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and subscribe to my channel to start your holistic wellness journey for your mind, body, and skin. Thanks for watching.